Hey Filmmaker Shung here, in this video we're going to show you how to make this rain effect inside of Premiere Pro which is a nice rain effect for behind your text or be like for your intro or you can even use it as an actual rain uh, on top of your normal clip. So let's start and make this video. So first we have here a timeline already and we are going to make a new item, choose black video and then press OK. Drag this black video onto your timeline here, so it's just totally black. And the effect that we mainly need to use is called cell pattern. You can find it under video effects, then generate, and then cell pattern. Grab and put this onto the black video. So what it makes is this funky uh, yeah, cell pattern, and we're going to change some of the... Uh, yeah parameters. We're going to change contrast to 10,000 which you need to drag with your mouse yourself because you can't type in 10,000. So now we have this. Uh, the size 60 is okay, fine here and disperse to 150. And we're going to animate this. So we're going to hit the stopwatch here. So we have this keyframe move to the front. And now we're going to change this to 2,000. So we have it at the speed of like it falling down. And also we're going to change the evolution so it doesn't fall down just straight, but also have like a slightly, uh, yeah, slight other extra movement, like if there's slight wind going on. So we're going to hit the keyframe here and we're going to change this to 2x. So move this keyframe to the back. So now when we look at it, it looks a little bit like snow falling down. So now when we look at it, it looks more like snow. So we still have a few more steps. So we're going to hold down Alt and drag this clip down. So we have a duplicate of it. And the bottom one, we're going to change uh, one parameter here. We're going to change the size to 20. And now we're going to go up here and we're going to change the blend mode of this to multiply. So what it does, it's actually now you can see the smaller dots falling and now we have the rain effect. So it does of course now looks like it's falling really slow but we can alter this quite quickly. We go to the offset and we change this to 10,000 and the one on the bottom also change this to 10,000. Now if we look at it we have like a much faster rain falling and now it has like the actual quick speed of rain falling down but uh, yeah if you want to add this on top of a video we recommend use right mouse click and choose nesting to nest it together and then afterwards uh, if you want to put it on top of a clip choose the blending mode of uh, lighten or screen so it's you have like these white dots up on top of your normal video and that was how to make rain inside of Premiere Pro hope you've learned something from this tutorial if you want to learn more and see more videos of my channel make sure to hit that subscribe button here below thank you guys for watching and CD out